Geralt found Ciri at last, on the Isle of Mists where the Elven Mage had concealed her. There was no time to rejoice, for the wild hunt descended on them. They fled, Ciri teleporting them to Kir Morin, where their friends awaited. The wild hunt arrived at Kir Morin soon after. A great battle ensued, and the fortress's defenders might all have perished had Ciri not demonstrated her powers. So sudden and violent was her outburst that the wild hunt was forced to withdraw. The battle was won, the war had barely started. Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Trophonet and welcome back to The Witcher 3 on the Death March difficulty. Well, on the uh, aftermath of the Battle of Kaer Morhen. We're at the quest Blood on the Battlefield, which is uh, part of the main quest, of course. But uh, first we're gonna start talking to everybody who's here. So let's go from left to right, shall we? Well, from left to right if I face the uh, funeral fire. Hello, Ermian. Thank you. Please. She was my ward, too. And the old should only ever stick around to help the young. You know, this hardly ends your struggle. I know. Whatever you aim to do now, remember you'll find souls willing to aid you in Skellige. Myself, Prach, his children. We will remember, Hermion. We will remember. Thanks. I'll remember that. I shall take another look at the wounded. But I'll need to go soon. I'll leave you some medicines. Thanks, Ermion. Go in health, Ermion. Till we meet again. So it's also really interesting, the uh, the intro cinematic, as you might have seen for this episode, this, uh, the animated intro cinematic, which told us what happened at the battle, is still spoken by uh, Vesemir, which makes this all the more sad. So, Eskel. What's on your mind? Care Morin. Can't imagine this place without Vesemir. I'll head down the valley soon, and find somewhere else to winter next year. We understand, Daskal. We understand. Because we can't really change his mind on that point, so, uh. I get you. Try my luck in Lormark. There's always work where there's war. After that, we'll see. Till next time. See you, Wolf. See you, Eskel. So the death of Vesemir also uh, means that, well, Kermoran is going to start emptying. So let's talk to our next Witcher, Leto. That was tough. We managed. Thanks for helping. You're welcome. Well, he's not the emotional type, is he? Want to stay at Kaer Morhen? Probably not. Uh, so what will you do? What will you do now? Probably head east, cross the mountains. After that, we'll see. Farewell. That was short, but hey, farewell, Letho. Vess and Roach. So, tell me. I can say I've seen it all now. I still don't believe everything that happened. Yeah, the wild hunt is uh, pretty wild, but how can I thank you? Risked your lives for me. How can I repay you? We'll think of something, right? Definitely. <laughs> what will you do? We're bound for Novigrad to fight the next fight. If you miss us, look for us at the camp. Okay, we will. Goodbye, Vernon and Vess. Uh, then we have Lambert. Or Kira. Thanks for everything you did for me and Siri. May I be honest? Had I known what would happen here, I'd never have come anywhere near Kaer Morhen. Probably. I'm glad I could help. But I shall leave as soon as Lambert feels better. Okay, going together? You're going together? I've an idea, but I need a Witcher to help me see it through. Lambert has agreed to assist me. Hmm. <laughs> Interesting Good partnership. Luck. And thanks again. We're even now. We're even now. Yes, we are. Hello, Lambert. Can we talk? What about? Find yourself uh, a new girlfriend, are you? Try not to argue with anyone, can you? How are you holding up? Holding up all right. Love questions like that. Am I holding up? What? My dick? This is shit, Geralt, and you know it. You, okay, the old man couldn't live Lambert, forever. take it easy. 
Even told Eskel that when it came time, I'd get his sword. Fits my hand perfectly, you know? But... Vesemir deserved a better death. Whereas he died like a louse. Crushed. We'll avenge him. Doesn't look that rosy to me. Well, vengeance isn't really rosy, isn't it? So thanks, Lambert. Goodbye. See you later. Yeah, take care. So Lambert and Kira will be on their way together from now on. Which is a really interesting partnership, I think. Hello, Hjalmar. There you are. Crying shame about Vesemir. I'm sorry. Thanks for your help. I had a debt to pay. Straight back to Skellige, are we? Heading straight back to Skellige. Wouldn't be right to tarry. War with the Black Ones won't wait. That's right, and the Nilf Guardians are you still at their me, doorstep, you know. so... Uh, Always. I thanks. know. Thanks. Thanks, Hilmar. And then, of course, our trusty dwarf, Zoltan. Come to see how I'm feeling. Thanks. Not bad. That's good. Ah, son. Horrible about Vesemir. I know you were close. Thanks. We were. Listen, far be it from me to stick my beard but it'll no scratch an itch. So don't take this the wrong way. I want to help, whatever you decide, but to my mind we've got to counterattack. We've got to find the hunt, Eredin, and charge at them both like a bull at a heifer. Sounds like a plan, but uh, there's not many of us left because most of the people that are here will probably leave, so not that simple. Not that simple, unfortunately. We have no way of finding them. They find us easily. Can take us by surprise whenever they want. Forgive me, Geralt, but that's the blathering of a man who clearly can't snap out of it after a tragic loss. Oh, take it, it easy, Sultan. Sleep it off, whatever it takes. Just get yourself together and think things through. That I'll we do will. That, Sultan. Okay. And then, of course, the last thing we can do is I think we can pay our respects ourselves. I'll remember your teachings always. And the sacrifice you made. Goodbye, Fazemir. Goodbye. So, with our uh, morning pr process completed, I think we've uh, talked to everyone here. I haven't missed anyone? No, I haven't. So, let's go to uh, to Care Morn again. Zurel can harness immense amounts of the power. And talk to Avalok. Why has no one taught her to control this? Actually, some did teach her. Clearly, to no effect. I'll gladly argue with you about this some other time. Okay. We're already fighting. Haven't had a chance to talk. Thanks for your help. And for looking after Siri. You will thank me later. Now we must take Zirel from here, Haida. And then gather a greater force. Anyone, everyone we could count on came here to care more. Which is why we must seek the help of enemies. Magic is our best defense against the hunt. We need sorceresses. Arch mistresses of magic. You more of arch. them! Okay, the lodge is in shambles, though. Many of the lodge's members are dead. The rest are in hiding. Philippa Eilhart, Margarita Loantil, and Fringilla Vigo are likely still alive. And Francesca and Ida? Think they'd agree? I think they'll take convincing. Would you rather speak to Kira alone? That would probably be best. I think Kira already decided she will leave. So I don't think she will help, but... Doesn't look like we have much of a choice. Don't trust the Lodge one bit. But doesn't seem like we have a choice. Because we don't. Okay. I've made an agreement with the Emperor. In exchange for its help, the Lodge will be granted amnesty and find asylum in Nilfgaard. That will be our bargaining chip. Siri is gonna I be mad to in a second, I think. Sorceresses. Will you help me? Of course. Even got an idea where you could start. Damn it! There Again, she goes. Without even asking what I think, I've had enough of this. I won't be taken somewhere like a bundle. I will not sit and twiddle my thumbs. I am sick of waiting, sick of hiding. And uh, you're right, of course. You're right. 
prove today you can take care of yourself. Easier to pat someone on the back and hope things will work out than it is to face the truth. I don't Jirelle think you've a great power she cannot control. done much. She is a danger to herself, to others. Until she learns to control it, she should remain isolated. First of all, bollocks. Second, if you're going to speak of courage, at least address me directly, and not through Geralt. No, especially since you I'm two gone. have been uh, traveling together. It's kind of a weird relationship between those two, between Avalok and Ciri. I'll go after her. Better go after her. Wait, she needs time. We must let her resolve her grief on her own. Then we should start training as soon as possible. She must learn to control her abilities. This training really necessary? You saw what happened. She could be a greater threat than the hunt. Yeah, Fine. she could we'll have killed us all. Well longer, then join you and Triss in Novigrad. Meet at Dandelion's Inn. Come Sounds on, like a plan. The sooner we leave, the better. See ya. Don't you guys teleport? So I don't think five minutes will be the difference. That's where we got the wolf gear. Right over there. So, a few days later, an 800 experience on top of that. And a lot of character entries apparently, because that flashed across this screen. Geralt uh, sharpening his blade. It's not working, don't you see? And Ciri's training is uh, not going so well, apparently. How many times must I try? As many as it takes. But I'm not getting anywhere. So I might have told you this before, but Zirael is Elven for Swallow, which is a uh, series nickname. And now it's our we time to. Uh, Talk to her a bit. Lift her spirits as Didn't it, make it uh, our first time out on the gauntlet either. As Geralt, it would please, be not now. By comparison, the gauntlet was a walk in the park. But that's not the point. What is? Avalar says nothing will come of this until I stop thinking about the battle. But at the moment I find it impossible to fill my head with kittens and vanilla pudding. So now we have uh, one of the five, I think. Very important decisions to make. Manage to pull yourself together. Focus. No matter what's happening. The five decisions that uh, decide what the ending will be. So uh, I think I know what might lift your spirits. Hmm. There's a certain ancient method. Vesemir taught it to me, and Barman taught it to him. Will you take me into the mountains and make me drink hemlock? No. Nope. Like the druids have used it for centuries. It always works. Hey! Snowball fight. Because the other option is uh, to drink Still ourselves drunk. But that's not as positive as this is. Because we can actually play this. Hey, that's cheating. <laughs> Win. We'll see about that. What is she doing? Okay. Oh. I don't actually know how to make more snowballs. How do I make more snowballs? Loot! Not that! Stop doing that! Stop doing that! God! I always miss her! I need more snowballs! There he goes! Okay! 
says the girl teleporting. God damn it. Did I hit her? No, I didn't. No. 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 So you can hit her when she's making snowballs of her own. One more to go. There we go. So there we go. That makes her laugh. Right. That really works. Glad we could help, Siri. Glad to be of service. So what now? I'll go see where our dearest sage is. That was one creepy smile on Siri's face. Okay, then. You don't have to be an asshole about it, Geralt. 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 Yes! Okay, we're awake. What? What's happening? Get up. We must go. I've saddled the horses. Go Siri, where? It's the crack of dawn. Where do you want to go? To Velen, Bald Mountain. But a few days till the Witch's Sabbath. And guess who's the guest of honor? The Witch's Sabbath. Enlighten me. Don't know. Enlighten me. Imlareth. Okay then. Better chance to get him. Where do you get this idea? What's gotten into you? I must avenge Vesemir. The Sabbath. It's the perfect opportunity. Imlarith will be drunk among his cohorts, caught up in the revelry. He'll not expect the blow. Sounds like a great plan, but uh, how did you learn about that anyway? How do you learn all this? Imlarith? The Sabbath? Avilach. He told me of those who chase us. Claims knowledge itself can tip the scales. Come, we shall talk on the way. Uh, well, we gotta visit the Emperor first. Wait, something I gotta tell you before we go. Because this is another one of no, those major Emperor, decisions. You found. Yennefer mentioned something. Wanted you to visit him. Why would you tell me now? Because this could be your last chance to see your father. Think I should go? Well, um... Uh... This is another one of those major decisions. This is not the decision we uh, we have to make, but it will be uh, there in uh, five minutes. So, uh, but we only get the option if we actually go to the emperor. So, uh, I wonder what she says if you if you go for gotta make your own decision. Hmm. Got to decide for yourself. But I want your opinion. Should I go or not? Okay then. Well, you should. Probably just wants to talk. How can you be sure? What if he wants something more? Promised yeah, he probably has do anything. ulterior motives, but... So I should go? He is your father. Vizima is on the way. I suppose we can drop in. Okay, then let's go. Ready? Yes, we are. Let's go. So back at the royal palace in Vizima. Let's see what the emperor has to say. Now that we found his daughter. Because he's going to make a bit of a show about this. But we have one very important decision to make. Your Imperial Majesty, Geralt of Rivia. Geralt. Cyrilla Fiona Ellen Rhiannon. Queen of Sintra, Princess of Bruges, and Duchess of Sutton. Heiress to Innes Ard Skellig and Innes Ann Skellig, and Suzerain of Atra and Abiara. Get used to it. That's before a whole mouthful. Every soul from Nilfgaard to the Dragon Mountains will kneel before you. I did not expect you to keep your word, Witcher. We're here thanks to Siri. Siri wanted to hear what you have to say. 
And she will. Your reward. And now comes the... Because he makes a big ceremony about this. And we can actually decide... He didn't do this for the coin, because the other option is really bad for Ciri's mind. Didn't come to collect on a deal. You asked me to bring your daughter here. I did just that. Look at that. A Ciri smile. Hear you out. Then we leave. Are you sure? Never yes. again would you need to stalk monsters while wading through sewage. I'm sure. We don't need the cash, there we go. I understand. Honor prevents you from accepting coin. Well, it's more than that, since uh, Siri is in like a daughter to us, Stalin, more than to you. Guardian awaits you in the stables. Treat it as an expression of my gratitude. Thank you. So Not I see that as one of the... I the downsides to, to coming to Vizima at this point, because we lose Roach. We can't use Roach anymore from now on. We oh, use that uh, Nilfgaardian Stallion now. It's a better horse, but I kind of like Roach. So now Siri has a little chat. With her father. White Wolf, good to see you. Hello, uh, you had no General. Crossing the Ponta, I trust. No. Vorhis. It's fortunate you did not choose to ride through Rhind, a troubled region still. Radovid seeks to breach the front in the west. Oh, does he now? Not succeed. Not before the princess becomes empress and we bring order to the area. The funny thing is, uh, in my original playthrough, I never actually went to Vizima to uh, talk to the Emperor again. So this is all new for me as well. Can't be sure if Siri will agree to becoming Empress even, so uh, that's all between her and her father right now. Siri hasn't agreed to that yet. Yes, of course, she's tactful, not one to celebrate an offer not yet made. But this is not the kind of offer one refuses. Of course it's not. Or isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't it? Isn't I, it? You know, I'm Eddie sorry, I, I kept repeating that. Can you imagine? I thought only the wine-addled minds of bards and poets could give birth to such stories. I hate his voice. ...of the most powerful ruler in the continent's history returns on the eve of his final triumph to embrace her inheritance. Simpletons adore such stories as they do the princesses, ever beautiful and delicate mother. Yeah, thanks for that. Saved by the door. Geralt, we're leaving. Okay. So nice to see you, my lady. Likewise. Time we were on our way. A shame you can't stay. I hope to continue this on another occasion. That makes will. one of us. <laughs> Someone's mad. So goodbye, General Forrest. Well. Uh, what happened? If he thinks he can buy me. He is sorely mistaken. He offer anything specific? Yes, very specific, and thoroughly absurd. Sorry, I don't want to talk about it. Not now, at least. Well, okay then. You. When you're ready, let's go. Let's leave Vizima behind for now.